Ladies and gents, the alleged criminal conduct complaint, and this also includes against other officers of the court, this document is now complete. You will now be able to add your information. This document is locked, so you won't be able to change any of the wording or edit it. Sorry. The reason for that being is so that it keeps uniformity. When you click on each one of these, for instance, that one, and that one and that one if you need to it's clickable the only ones let's go down and I would take the time to read it before filling it out make sure that each one of the statements if there's a statement you don't agree with just put a line through it okay so let's continue uh, there is a section and it is this section where if you need to fill out multiple boxes you'll have to fill it out after you print it because this the way it was set up it was only designed for one box to be filled out let's as a matter of fact we're gonna bring this a little bit larger so you can see it in up close the entire form now you will notice that this form when it is put into the computer uh-oh. That's because it's on my computer. I'm not supposed to be able to do that, so I will have to make one more adjustment on this section right here because this is not supposed to be moving. Let's see. Hold on. One second. Let's make sure of something. Let's do that again. Okay, directly... Okay, just wanted to make sure. Whew, I thought I made a mistake. And this is a different one. So let's see if we can get rid of proof of claim. Okay, so can't get rid of it. It won't go nowhere. See, still there. So you can't alter it. You can click on the fields, but you can't alter it. So that's just letting you guys know. I thought I made a mistake when I was working with the program because we're going to be doing another document for our new SAP packers the same way for them to fill out. So, ladies and gentlemen, using three different programs to get this done. Finally, uh, I can only tell you I do like the fact that it took over three weeks to get it done. And this is me focused and working on it and thinking about it. But as I stated before, these are links when you click on them they actually do work for a link they when you click on it it will take you so you can verify that it will take you to the actual link and the information so that you can know for instance the right to petition for redress is a binding and it's supposed to be an valid right so I apologize there are some of the writings that were small like this that I could not correct and I do apologize to you that it will not be corrected anytime soon I've been up since 530 as I said in the last video it is now 10 if I can still see 1007 so I'm just too tired so you guys are just gonna have to understand that the typos there are very few but they're in the smaller writing and they do not affect the context of the document okay there is probably there are a couple of areas that I have not corrected the typos so my thinking is I probably will correct that before this video goes up so just stay tuned we have two videos going up talking about this same document. It will be up tonight. We are creating the folder and we're loading it up tonight. So gotta go. Y'all take care. But this document is finally complete. It will be up. Most of the typos I will correct now. And like I said, I'm running on fumes, but I'm going to correct.